Hi guys, I'm Exact Chaos, and welcome back to another episode of City Skylines. We are playing Park Life, and we are filling out more and more of the city. How are you finding this series? Do you like the city de development? Do you like it filling in slowly? Look at the parking, well utilized over here at the train station. I'm wondering how our new train services are actually working over here. Whether they are kind of getting in each other's way or what is happening doesn't seem to be are we getting people walking up here oh tons of people walking up here tons and tons is there a game on i'm not sure i'm not sure how i know if a game is on or not the sparking is very well utilized where's my green train they're getting stuck over here This one almost starts needing a bit of a bypass over here. It's one of the green trains right there. So that one's end of the line, so that that works okay. This is problematic. Oh no no. Not really. Actually works very well. <laughs> it's just going to be difficult on those platforms to understand what's happening. But yes, this line is getting pretty busy. Yeah, I don't think we can... We can't accommodate any more train services on these lines. But they're working pretty well at the moment. A little bit slower than they probably should be working. Ah, excellent. We've got everything powered over here. Powered and working. Starting to fill that area slowly, very slowly. I actually want to make sure that we uh, fix our demand a little bit. Just to make sure that this keeps growing and, and so on, fills in and so on. Okay, so what's next? What is the next piece? Do we just keep filling in this? We could do pretty cool layouts over here. But I'm also pretty tempted to start maybe looking at what kind of layout we can do for a theme park. Um, but I'm a little worried. I kind of wanted this area to be theme park. But I'm kind of worried in that, that we don't have a nice flat area. What, I'm, what, what may be better is if we have this area as theme park right over there. Hmm, I'm not sure. I'm not sure what's the right thing to do here. Have people walking here? Not yet. Still a little far to walk to those areas. Oh, you know what? One thing that we probably need over here is a bit of a university kind of thing. So, uh, nothing too crazy. But yes, I'm, I'm in the... Uh, I think... Uh, that's like a law school campus or something. So what does this do? How many students? Like 500 students. That's 4,000. A Jubilee Hall. That's way too much, right? Is that students or... The problem is it says student capacity everywhere, right? Regardless of what the kind of school is. So University Science Hall. Ooh. That's pretty good. That's very pricey though. 350 only. That's crazy. And that's a faculty building. So I'm actually tempted to do a bit of a university kind of thing set up right over here somewhere. Yeah, so if I was keen on doing the... Um, I could actually do a bit of a university campus over here, but I don't have the, have the bits and the pieces for doing that. And I'm not sure it's something that I'm, I want to spend a ton of time on. Doing the faculty buildings and all of those kind of things. Uh, because I don't, I don't have the assets and I really don't. Yeah, no, let's not do that. Let's just do a basic university somewhere. So what does this one cost us? 75 and that's 4,500 students. So that 
will be pretty decent. And the question is, do we run it in somewhere like this, where you have access to the train station, you're right, right next door to the IT cluster. So if I do something like that, you know, how does that work? That ties in. Yeah, it ties in quite nicely over there. It's underneath there. That piece is funny, but anyway, it doesn't, doesn't matter too much. The road is still on top here. That ties in together quite well over there. It's not too far from the train station, so the train station can, uh, can make use of it fairly well. Mm -hmm. It's nice and neat next to the IT cluster here, so that's okay. And these guys can also start making their walking over there. And that makes me think that this, the rest of this area needs to be uh, residential as well. So let's see, how are we going to run um, our residential layout over here? Are we going to... Okay, so let's grab a bit of a standard road. Let's maybe do something like that. Let's get a bit of a straight tool going on over here. Yeah, I'm not sure that works. So if we say this is the starting point. And if we then go over to something like this. Now we probably need snapping back on. Yeah. So if we... Uh, we do a little something like so and so. Um, how does that work? Meandering a little bit, going up and over there. That's not too bad. I'm 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 kind of liking the idea of doing that. Um, to, to do something over here. No, let's uh, let's make very sure that we um, are gonna do a little something like that. Yeah, over the hill here, that ties in together over there. That I'm not sure about that side of things, but this kind of looks okay. I'm tempted to tie it in over here. So if we do that. But then this actually. Actually this. In my mind. Needs to be a bit of a roundabout actually. <laughs> so that that. Yeah, a bit of a roundabout over here. Slightly offset kind of piece. So if we do a bit of this. Right, and we do a bit of that. And we do a bit of this. Okay, and we do a bit of that. Then that, all of a sudden, is a roundabout. And all we need to do is definitely make sure that this becomes a one way. Okay. Turn around, buddy. <laughs> Turn around. And that intersection there we need to we need to clean that up. So that doesn't actually work. So let's uh, let's make sure we run that one into this corner over here. I like I like the idea of that a little bit. It's it actually looks pretty cool and interesting. And that makes that work as well. So let's uh, just get our standard, our standard little road here. And uh, yeah, so we need to so if we do something like that. Yeah, how does that look? That is actually a quite interesting one. And now what we can also do is we can almost trim this. Well, what we'll do is we will try and uh, make use of this as much as possible. So what I actually want us to do is we need to trim this out a little. So actually, let's let's redo this piece ever so quickly. But I want to do.
So if we say something like that, that's kind of worth worth the while, and that actually looks works quite nicely, I think. And actually, the one thing I'm also quite keen on doing is maybe tying that a little bit like that and a little bit like so. Yeah. How about that? Up there. That is quite an interesting little little shape and figure that I'm doing over there. So now we can actually run a bit more roads over here. So effectively saying, how about something like, like this, and a little something like that, to try and get a bit of a terrace effect going on. And that kind of works for us as well. Excellent. So that actually, actually, I like I like the idea of doing that. Makes use of this uh, this hill a little bit better. So yes, really, now we can can start filling in some stuff over here also. Yeah, it's an interesting one. It's an interesting shape and stuff that's going on there. And uh, hopefully, it's not too too painful in terms of. Uh, in terms of traffic so let's uh, I just want to make sure that we uh, definitely don't want to get any of the uh, parking on here so no parking no parking on this road thank you very much um, over here as well let's make sure to clean up our parking provision um, I don't think over there not on the tunnel maybe in here no this is more of an arterial piece so no parking on these st stretches please thank you There we go, no parking there. Nice. Okay, so we still have that demand, which obviously we, we put the demand there. Okay, so now, if we decide to start filling out some of these pieces, uh, and I don't think we've got any water here, so be up to us to sort that out before we go too far so what I definitely want to make sure is that we actually tie in some some pathways from this side to that side so let's quickly grab a bit of that let's uh, just do a little bit of this so it feels a little bit more natural not that that is very natural but anyway so at least there's some action um, to be taken there so oh, actually at the same time we probably want just uh, just make sure we take turn snapping off and uh, I thought snap oh, I didn't turn it off snapping snapping off there so we'll tie that one in there and I'm kind of tempted to Oh, this one in over there perfect so now what I want to do is let's get rid of that now that is funny but in the, at least we'll have some some walkability through here also uh, this piece we may have to tie those in together straight away over there excellent so that's starting to fill in quite nicely over here um, having all of this run across across here should we do a bit of parking ah we're missing the water let's actually grab the water quickly see about how we fill that in so um 
something like that and something like that so that now we actually have some water running through here make sure that we fill oh look at that wow now of where where are all these people going walking their dogs toolboxes and stuff in hand excellent so doing doing the walking journey is it up here whether that they're walking seems to be up there up there all the way this way and to the train station lots of people coming out of the train station how many people on that train actually pretty full nice so the train station is doing its thing lots of people walking everywhere Coming around here. Good stuff. Is there a bit of a... Uh, I'm kind of doing a bit of park assets. Maybe we should put a bit of a park assets in here. Jokes park. Hmm. Uh, obviously levels for these assets is a bit of a problem. Levels are a problem if we're doing assets like this. Okay. Something like, uh, it's going to cause craziness. It is going to cause craziness, is it not? So let's say we do something like that. How does that work? That looks horrible. That looks really horrible. Thank you, but no thank you. That looks very bad. What is these? What are these things? Oh. Uh, can we just do... Uh, actually, some of these things. Like a plaza with trees, maybe. Can we squeeze it in there? No, we cannot. I want to do the plaza with trees. Over there, that side. Yeah, there we go. Plaza with trees. That actually works. But we should probably do one on either side of, or something to that effect. So if we do this... Oh! We lost that massive building over there. Anyway, I think that's kind of okay. We'll probably get another building in there soon. But yeah, this area is so busy. Lots of people walking, walking all the way from the train station to here. Um, at some point, I think it's probably good if we... What are you doing? Electric parking. Um, at some point, I think it's probably good if we... Um, if we actually uh, <clears throat> get a bus route or something going on. And I'm kind of tempted to tie this in over here. Something like so, huh? Now, we can get straight in and that way so the, the, the traffic will be uh, less of an issue. Not that I'm sure we actually had real traffic issues, but, but that'll work um, at the same time. So now, I think from a power perspective, we're actually... Ooh, we're not tying in over here. But what we could do is um, just do that. And then we'll get rid of these pieces. Okay, and then I'm tempted we're just going to fill in a few more of these big boys over here. It's a smaller one that's popped up in that space now. That actually works. Yeah, so we'll get a few big, more big ones popping up in that little section. And we can run it around a little bit, even fill in on this side a little. I think that's actually not a bad idea if we do do that. <clears throat> Lots of people walking down here, though. Okay, so let's uh, let me fill in some more, some more of this. So let's do that. We'll get these things leveling out. I'm probably not going to have that one right there. 
So let's start by filling in a few of these things and see what that does because the one will be high and the one will be low kind of thing. Um, and I'm a little worried that on this side it's going to be something like that. Yeah, so now it's, it's, it's stepping it up a little. But what we could do is we could actually do a little bit more office building stuff in here. On this road, do we need, how's, how's this going? Okay, so that's, so elementary school, actually, let's just get in elementary school and see how that goes. So this area is not too good at it, so let's maybe squash in an elementary school over there. Give a little better action. Um, definitely keen on doing some of these things. I mean, uh, even a doctor's office right there. Maybe a little bit of uh, a little bit of a rural police station kind of thing, like so. And maybe some firefighting abilities. Ooh, firefighting. Something small. Something small. Maybe this one, the BTB firehouse. Uh, right there. Yeah. Yeah, that works. That works. A little bit of a community center and feel right over there. Um, there's a lot of shops and stuff over here. So I don't know if we really need to do more shops here. But maybe a handful, one or two. That area is uh, starting to look not too bad. I'm tempted to do a bit more, a bit of a park situation somewhere. Uh, not quite what I had in mind. If we, some of these things, that's a fishing island. And if we say, I don't want that because I actually want to do a theme park. What is this? Uh, music theater. So the music theater over here somewhere. How about that? That actually doesn't look too bad. That all works kind of well. Almost like it's built for it. Nice. I think all of that is, is actually working, tying in quite nicely. Some more industry stuff. Should we add a few more of these buildings? We're a little tempted to do so. Gets these people the ability to go back onto that road. Not that they want to do that. Can they make a U-turn here? I'm wondering if we allow the U-turn. But it would be a difficult one to squeeze in so late in the game. It's busy and that, that movement is very busy. These two movements are quite busy. The uh, Our two directional ramps are not. <laughs> Probably did this the wrong way around. Probably needed the uh, directional ramp to go this way and maybe that way. But it's not like it's not working. It's just a little, uh, a little problematic maybe. I'm kind of wondering if we do add, if we do add a little bit of uh, a bridge connection in over here that then we can even almost tie it in on the center if we do a bit of a ramp that we tie in over here well the question is do we do we allow people to get in from that side too so if we do something, I mean, in this area, it's a little problematic to uh, to do that. <clears throat> but I'm kind of tempted to to squeeze in uh, a, a kind of a smaller kind of interchange. 
So like, what are we saying? Maybe uh, I'm I'm tempted to do a bit of a a bit of a maybe a, a raised. You know what? You know what would be cool. If we put a bridge over the top here into a roundabout that we tie into. That could actually work. That could actually work. So let's do that roundabout. Um, well, let's do it with highways. It's probably the right tool for the job. Uh, let's switch this off. And now let's see. So if we're saying, let's do it somewhere over here. Uh, let's do that. Um, oh, actually, I do want it to be on the ground. Let's switch on snapping, and I do want it to be on the ground. Uh, and yes, so let's do five by five by five by. Come on. Can I make sure we snap to this piece instead? Okay, well, let's try the other way around. Okay, so if we say that, now let's just flip these around. Okay, if we say something like that, and now we do a bit of a bridge over there, and that is, but that's not going to work, is it? Because that's too close. We can't actually tie can we tie it off here and in there oh, let's try it let's try it so if we say if we do that if we do that and we do that right and now what we do is we we grab a road like that one. Well, let's run that straight. No, that's not what I wanted to do. I uh, need to do this now. Okay, so go back to the, that one. No, too much. Is that too much? Or is that just that's just right, is it? So how's that? That's an interesting one. And what we could do is we could actually have a road run in that direction as well. The only thing I wanted to double check is make sure that these things are not clipping and they are not clipping. Actually, that works really quite, quite well, actually. So now there's actually a way for you to get back onto the right side of things. Oh, the one thing I should, however, say is we probably need to just kind of... Uh, Kind of tweak things just a bit. So just a little bit more. Um, just a little bit more like that. Okay, so similarly over here. Something like that, huh? It's fairly decent right there. Um, can I just drop this a little bit just so it like looks a little bit better there? That's fine. So now there's actually the option of getting getting back into this direction. And that could actually become mm, something that we tie in over here also. 
we could run this thing around um, around here that could be a bit more of a yeah absolutely I think that can actually work quite well so we have that connection over there we've got this connection on this side so you have to kind of run it through there if you want to if you want to make this turn yeah I, I like it I like it I think it's I think it's worthwhile a worthwhile way of getting in here and then let's grab the um, just one of these just kind of tempted to just grab one of those and what we'll do is just we'll just run it run it straight out of there and now we almost want to do Just want to do something like that. Yeah, but this is going to get busy. We'll have to keep an eye on it. It'll definitely get busy. How's this filling in? Oh, it's filling in nicely. This is looks weird, but it kind of works. There's still a lot of room to fill in things over here. A lot of stuff being unloaded and things like that over here. I like the IT cluster in the middle there. Gives this area a bit of purpose. Um, I like it. Uh, you know what? Let's just fill in a little bit more um, of the residential demand up here. Okay, and even on that side. Okay, so let's just fill that in a little. Uh, we may not do it straight up there. I do it a little something like that, maybe. So and so, and we can tie these in over here. But that's just that just helps things out a little. Actually, let's do a bit of that. See how that works. Nice. So that's filling in nicely over there. Good little layout there so this is going to get pretty busy it's going to get pretty busy over here and the question is if this is actually going to be able going to be able to hold its its own over here but i like the i like the i like the little bit of a different different shape trying to provide um, a little bit of a better action piece over here but yeah this this road eventually not sure eventually if that is how we're going to going to use it or whether we're going to try across over here this is the other place right if we flatten this section out a little bit we could actually do a bit of a theme park on this side and i'm a little bit more tempted to do that so if we then um look at uh, maybe a suburban interchange i mean not suburban an urban interchange over here um so we have a big road and then what we do is we have our our turning our our problem turn movement from that side come in with a bridge yeah that could be that could be quite cool and then we run this up here we bridge it over this side we flatten the stop area out and we do our theme park over here i like the idea of that what we could also then do is we could run the rail um along here somewhere over there and across to that side so there's a rail station over there i like it i do like it i think that is a pretty good idea uh, let's quickly add a bit of water right here and then we will call this episode to a close but really oh and I think there's probably a little bit more that we're missing hmm. something like that excellent and we could fill in a little something over here also I like the idea of you know that stepping it out a little over there and, and so on I think I like it it's it's pretty good Maple Hills over here, with this area, Coleridge Square. It does look like a bit of a square. Yeah, that's pretty busy. We probably need a bit of signal control over here, to be really honest with you. So uh, let's do switch signal control on over there, and we'll switch signal control on over here as well. And we'll switch signal control on... <coughs> over there too 
So the pedestrians and all of that will be under signal control there. There's a lot happening there. This is all working. This thing in the end may require some signal control, but for the moment it works pretty well. There's some traffic actually making use of this piece of road. So that's not too bad. I like that idea. Yeah, I like it. I like it. I think this is this is pretty cool. This is pretty cool. We're really uh, filling in the area nicely and maybe instead of doing the theme park somewhere over here, I, th I like the idea of placing it out here on this little island piece. That is actually qu uh, quite, a, quite, a, quite a nifty idea in my mind. Uh, we just need to see how we tie this together and I'm, I'm keen on this urban, on this almost urban um, ramp thing that we're going to do over here. I like it. I like the idea of, of doing that. Cool. Okay, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Um, and I will see you in the next episode. Thank you. Bye-bye.